So truly breaking 49ers news. Kyle Shanahan, for the second straight day, had no new injuries to report. Now, he got up there at the lectern at SoFi Stadium after the win over the Rams on Sunday, and he said that, and he said, this feels awkward, but normally I list off all these injuries after these games, as is mandated by NFL rule, but he didn't have anything to list. And then, you know, that was obviously good news for the 49ers, but you feel that sometimes adrenaline wears off after 24 hours, and coach speaks again the next day, and some stuff will pop up on the injury report that wasn't there the day before. So I was anticipating maybe an ankle sprain or something to, to be on the list for Kyle Shanahan today. It wasn't. He got on the phone today, conference call, and he said, guys, again, no new injuries to report. So this is fantastic news for the 49ers entering their bye week because now they can truly focus on healing up. And you're talking about Debo Samuel, talking about Eric Armstead, Elijah Mitchell obviously has been on IR for quite some time. Jawan Jennings on the list as well. Jason Verrett's trying to make his return complete. He's back on the 53-man roster, but the 49ers are looking forward to getting him suited up. 49ers just need time to get healthy. And they have more time now with the bye week. And the worst feeling in the world would have been being stuck on a treadmill, right? You take some steps forward, but more guys get hurt against the Rams on artificial turf. But nobody got hurt against this Rams. Again, this was a huge win for the 49ers on the scoreboard, 31 to 14. But it was an even bigger win on the injury report. Nobody got hurt. Things are looking up for the 49ers with the Chargers next. But the bye week is first. And now the 49ers can truly, truly heal.